Hey yo, it's Kakalak and JFam. Welcome back to a brand new video. In this video, I'm getting a new special guest. Um, he's actually outside right now, and I just got the notification that he arrived. So uh, let's go check it out. Oh my gosh. Okay guys, you do not know how excited I am. Um, I'm gonna, I need to film the video of me unboxing this, and I have to rush this faster than I usually do. So I'll see you guys in the fish room. So guys, I just got my dream pet, which is an Eastern Hermans tortoise. Um, I'm about to film a video for my main YouTube channel, so you're gonna see kind of the setup of that. Um, I already have the camera and the lights and the other lights all set up ready for the unboxing because I was waiting for this. Um, I am going to turn on all, all the lights even though we are filming this early in the morning because it is currently 10.03. This is literally the coolest thing ever, being able to do all this. So anyways, everything else is set up, camera's already set up, got the SD cards, got the batteries, and uh, just gotta turn on all the lights and get ready to make this. So there is going to be a vlog after this that I'm just gonna show you guys. I'm, I'm probably gonna show a lot more of the tortoise in this vlog than I am on, even on my main channel. Just because I'll check up with the tortoise over the next couple hours and you guys will be able to see more than the main channel. So stick around if you're interested in that. This camera will be used kind of as a side angle for the entire video, so I'm not really gonna be talking to you. I'm mainly gonna be talking to the main camera, so sorry about that. But if you wanna watch this video that I'm filming right now, check out my main YouTube channel, link down below. But uh, I hope that all makes sense. I'm just super excited and it's early in the morning and I'm usually not awake this early, so yeah. Okay guys, I am back and right now I just set up the camera to do my next shot right over here facing on the terrarium and I got the light set up and I have the little princess. Dude, she is the little most adorable thing ever. Um, I'm gonna put her in her enclosure though and start filming on this camera, but I'll be back in a minute. Ooh, okay, so I just finished the video, but here is the little baby tortoise. Bro, she's inside her little hide. I don't know if you guys can see inside there. But um, I actually just ended up adding some new substrate to the floor just because it was a little hard for her to walk on. And the thing was, right when I was filming, at the end of the video, the camera died. Like the, the SD card filled up. But uh, yeah, dude, she is so dope. I will show you more of her later in the vlog. Um, but for now, I'm gonna, I think I'm gonna go try editing this footage and seeing what it turned out to be. Hopefully it's all good. She should be coming out every once in a while, and I have my heat monitor. Um, I did put some grass clippings right there. They like dandelion clippings, lettuce, and other greens, so we'll have to get some of those at the start. There she is. You can see her little shell. I think she's sitting there just so she gets a little bit of light, but she's kind of enclosed and she's away from me, because she doesn't know who I am yet. But I am your dad. Nice. Dude, she's adorable. Okay, um... The really nice thing about my entire setup in the basement is the fact that literally right here I have my editing setup, my editing studio. And I'm able to edit these videos just as quickly as I make them. Dude, I'm excited. This is literally my dream come true. So I might in this video show my mom and my sister her, or I might not because I might want to film that and have a separate video, just my family reacting to her. I'm gonna turn off my camera lights, get everything closed up. I'll see you guys in a couple minutes. Oh snap, I almost completely forgot to vlog. So it's been about an hour or two since the last time I picked up the camera. I just finished editing, but I'm about to pack some orders. Um, I think I had about like 10 today. But here are the cups that I uh, use to ship most of the things. And yeah, I'm just about to pick some of the snails. A lot of the snails I grow, I just pick from here and my duckweed and other things. And I also do pick up a lot of the snails from my grow chamber as we kind of talked about in the last couple vlogs. But yeah, and so far the tortoise has not really moved. Um, she is in there right now. Um, I haven't really messed with her and I'm not really going to. Maybe in a couple hours I might lift this up and just check on her, make sure she's doing all right. The temperature in here is about 70 to 80 degrees. There are different moisture pockets, so it's like probably a little colder over here and warmer over here. So I might move her around just so she stays warm and does okay. But uh, yeah, I'm sure the traveling and shipping and stuff was stressful on her. So I'm, that's why I don't really want to like put her out of her comfort zone and like stress her out even more basically. I do also have a whole mess to clean up. This was stuff from today's video and then this was stuff when I made my other video when I set up the enclosure. So I have a lot of garbage that I need to clean up because it is usually really clean down here. And also my desk's kind of messy. But yeah, um, I'm gonna go pack the orders and go to the post office. I'll bring you guys with. We also need to go to Walmart so we can get some food for our tortoise, like some extra lettuce and some other things that, that she'll really like. So yeah, all right, I'll see you guys in a couple minutes. <laughs> all right, so I just posted the video of the tortoise enclosure on my main channel, but now I'm about to run out to the post office. And I'll catch you guys in the car. Okay, I was about to go to the post office, but I just saw my mailman and he's actually gonna pick up my orders. 
so I won't even need to drive there, which is nice. But I still have to go to Walmart. Okay, well this kind of sucks. Um, currently, okay, so today is uh, Wednesday, April 15th, and today's the day that the stimulus check went out to almost every single American. I did not get one along with almost every college student because we're claimed by our parents. So that kind of sucks, but anyways, the entire parking lot is full, so I'd assume everyone is spending their check right now. And there are too many people in Walmart right now, like, I, I should have filmed it when I was coming in, and I'm not gonna risk it, I'm not gonna go in, it's not worth it. I possibly don't wanna get, like, COVID or anything, so, I'm not gonna get the food today. I think we do have some salad, but I wanted to get like more and more fresh stuff, but it'll be good enough for today and possibly tomorrow, and then I'll go to the store. But there are so many people out right now, like it's a crazy amount of people, and I don't wanna risk it. So I basically drove here for nothing. But I guess it was worth the drive. Oh, oh my gosh, oh my gosh, there's so much construction. We are literally driving on the other side of the road. Okay, but that's the lane that I'm supposed to drive in, but they like, literally just moved us over. It's kinda crazy. There's been so much construction. It's, this is so weird. It's like we're driving on the other side of there. Okay, I'm probably getting too excited about it. I think it's just funny. <laughs> Hi, can I have a large Dr. Pepper and a large Coke? Okay, so it is already almost five o'clock and um, the tortoise has been in her enclosure for a long time. So right now I'm going to do a health check, I guess. I'm going to lift up her hide and try checking on her just to see if she's doing okay. Because I really haven't seen her drink or anything, so... She buried herself. See her shell? Just because I haven't seen her moving at all. Hello. Sorry for waking you up, babe. I'm gonna put her hide back. Hello. Sorry for waking you up, babe. I just wanna make sure she's warm enough, too. I don't know, I put her by the food, so maybe she'll be interested in it. I also needed to uh, open this up so I can put some more water in there. Did notice it was a little dry. Okay, I'm not gonna annoy her anymore. Uh, I'm just gonna put her back. Over here. She did bury herself in, which is kinda cute. Okay, so she does not seem to be interested in water or food. Um, I guess she just probably is either tired or just wants to chill out after having to ship for so long. I was kind of worried because the temperature over there is probably in the low 70s to high 60s over in the enclosure, so I just want to make sure that she's warm enough. They can withstand lower temperatures like low 60s, so I mean we're good overall, but I just want to check up on her, make sure she's doing okay. I think I'm going to end the video right there. Um, I do also have to clean up the basement. I'll probably save that for tomorrow, honestly. I just... I'm kind of tired, I'm gonna take a nap. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Hit the like button, hit the subscribe button if you haven't already. Again, make sure to check out my main channel, Challenge of Wild, if you wanna see the full video of when I officially got her, or if you just like this side video. I'll catch you in the next one. Take it easy, peace.